What's up? What's going on out there, true gamers? That's right, Sega Man back here with another video. This is about my PlayStation collection. Every game I own for the PlayStation 1, yes, and the PlayStation 2. I know some of you guys are thinking, ah, oh, man, I don't think Sega Man was ever truly a real, a true uh, fan of anything Sony has, but you're wrong, because I've showed videos endlessly of, of stuff that I've gotten from uh, for Sony and the games I like. The Sony PlayStation 2, in my opinion, is the best Sony system that Sony could ever make. They have so many, many, many good games on there, especially at the time fighting games. Uh, the Dreamcast before the PlayStation 2 came out had, to me, the best fighting games uh, on it that it could offer. And as you know, uh, PlayStation came out with certain fighting games that you couldn't get on any other system, even when the original OG Xbox came out. After the OG Xbox been out for a while, it did get a few sweet fighting games, and one of them being DOA. DOA was its prize fighting game at the time and genre uh, of, that, of that era, you know. But um, I want to show you everything that I own for my PlayStation 1 and my PlayStation 2, the games that I own. So let's get into that. Uh, I'm going to show you some uh, PlayStation 1 games first. And this is every game that I own and I have picked up. And one of the games I got here is in an original case. I think when Sony first started out, they made the big cases like the Sega Saturn. The hinges on here are broke. Um, these were terrible cases for the Saturn and the PlayStation 1. But this is a good game on there. It's like a, it's like a top-down shooter, kind of like Zaxxon, and it's called Wavepoint. Uh, this was a great game for the original PlayStation 1. And most of these games that I'm showing you now, I picked up really, really cheap. Some $2, some $3, four dollars and I think some five dollars I didn't really I never picked up a PlayStation game honestly guys for more than let's say ten bucks okay in between those in between uh, ten dollars and down is what I played for I paid for my PlayStation games so this is Wavepoint uh, this was a great game for the regular PlayStation I play a lot of my PlayStation 1 games on my PlayStation 2 and that's the back there. So, and I'm not saying that if you like the PlayStation 3, I'm not saying it's not a cool system. I own one. I have the big one. I call it the Foreman, the Foreman PlayStation, because <laughs> it kind of reminds me of the Foreman grill. But that doesn't matter. It, it still had good games. Like I told you, I beat all the Resistance honors. Those were good shooter. It was a good shooter game, sci-fi shooter game for the uh, PlayStation 3. I, I love that that game, Resistance. It's a great, great, great series. Now, another one I got here is uh, Battle Arena Toshinden. Another great fighting game. Now, you young guys out there that uh, you know that like fighting games, if you're into PlayStation and you like PlayStation and you, you're looking for some fighting games, look into some of these games I'm going to show you and see if you can find them in, 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 for a good price and try them out, you know, if you have a PlayStation 2 or 1. If you don't, go out and try to find a used PlayStation 2 or 1 and become a true gamer of PlayStation and try these games out. And this is a great game, 3D game. And I also have um, a couple of Toshinden games for my, uh, you can't really see it because of the way the glossiness is on here, for my Sega Saturn. But this is a great game to have on your PlayStation. Uh, and it's a long hours of play for this, this game, man. It's a great fighter. So I recommend you guys picking that up. Now these ones we're going to go through real quick, man. I'm not going to, you know, some of the games I'm going to talk to you about, but I'm going to go through these real quick. Now, we got uh, Tiger Woods 98. I mean, Tiger Woods 99. I picked that up at a local uh, Goodwill. That was a, a dollar. Tiger Woods 2000 for the PlayStation. That was a dollar. Billiards was a dollar seventy-five for uh, I picked up uh, for the regular PlayStation. Uh, WCW versus the World. That was a dollar. And in my opinion, WCW was the best wrestling show that was ever on. You know why? Because I loved it, the NWO. 
So that was really great. I even like the I like the old school wrestling, but m in my opinion, WCW there will never be another WCW. To me, that was the best wrestling organization uh, in the early '90s. Now another one I got here is called Rival Schools. I got this actually I got this for fifty cent because it didn't have no cover or anything. So the the lady gave me a Rival School uh, fighting game for the PlayStation uh, for. Uh, I think it was 50 cents. You know what I mean? She's like, she's not going to charge me a lot for that. A lot of these uncovered games were either 50 cent or a dollar. Now, this other one I got here, um, it is um, Crusaders of Midnight of Midnight and Magic. This was also a dollar. It has the back cover, but it doesn't have the front. I didn't even try this game out yet. I got to give it a try out, but I picked it up. Uh, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> 75 cents so I'm going to try that out okay Alien Resurrection that's another one that was a dollar it doesn't have the back a great game it's very expensive now Marvel uh, Super Heroes vs. Uh, Street Fighter I picked that up for a dollar and I just put it in a generic case right here so great fighting game Soul Devirance this is a shooter got that for a dollar uh, I never didn't get to try this yet one if anybody knows about some of these games let me know I did not get to try these yet you know but I am gonna have to sit down and try out most of some of my PlayStation 1 games but uh, I didn't try this out one, one out yet but it's called one and it does have the back there. So maybe kind of like a Resident Evil. I don't know. Uh, Die Hard Trilogy. Uh, 99 cents. There's the back. Uh, Ita the Italian Job. $1.99. Has the back. Gran Turismo. Uh, yeah, Gran Turismo 2. A dollar. That's complete. And we got a uh, Twisted Metal 4. That was a dollar. Doesn't have the back. All right. Now, let me show you some more of my PlayStation 1 games. That's right. You know I'm a collector, baby. I don't play. All right. This one here is actually good, and I beat it. It is a Samurai Showdown 3. No no cover. That was a that was a dollar. Most of those games have come from the flea market or a used store, like a Goodwill. Great game. Rampage World Tour. That is complete. One of the best shooters ever made. This is uh G Darius. That was five dollars at a flea market, and that is complete. Austin Powers uh, Pinball. That was a dollar. An unusual game. I paid three. I think it was three dollars. I can't remember the price on it. And it's it's an amazing virtual sea monkeys. So for the PlayStation, I tried it out. Kind of weird, but it's still cool. Uh, one of the great games ever made. The best version of this game is on the 3DO. It is Road Rash. That was a few dollars. Tetris Plus. I can't remember how much that one was. Uh, X-Men vs. Street Fighter. Uh, I paid, I think it was around $5 for this. A guy that owned an old mom and pop movie shop, he sold his video games. You would have to show him at the counter which one you wanted, and then he would give you a price on it. So he told me 5 bucks, and that was a long time ago, in the early 2000s, I think. Because he was still open. But uh, it is complete. And it's it, this is a great game. Another great WCW Nitro. Awesome game. This one here is pretty weird. Evil Zone. It's a pretty cool fighting game. Anime sort of. I uh, paid a few dollars for this too. It was brand spanking new. But that's Evil Zone. And that is complete. Alright. Uh, this other one is Gookin'. Uh, Shooting King, another great game. This one was ten bucks. 
But it was well worth the $10. Great game. You know I like my smups. Uh, Stri uh, Striker1945. Got this at a uh, Goodwill. That was $3. RC Helicopter. A dollar. Uh, Pinball Pro Fantasy Journey. That was a dollar. Qbert for the PlayStation, two dollars. Uh, Extreme uh, two. That was a buck. Tekken three. That was three dollars. Oh man, I can't believe all these games. Sega Man has a PlayStation. I didn't think he liked PlayStation. Yeah, do I have two of these? I might have two of these, man. Tiger Woods, 99. That was a buck. I think I have two of those, man. I might have to trade that if somebody wants it. If they're into Tiger Woods, I don't know. Uh, Kiss Pinball. I think this is a rare pinball game. I haven't seen it out in a while, but it's from the group Kiss. They made a pinball game for the uh, PlayStation. That was a couple bucks. Pac-Man World. Couple dollars. Big uh, Big Race USA Pinball for the regular PlayStation. That was a dollar. Extreme Pinball. Two dollars. <sighs> Great shooter, man. For the PlayStation. Ray Storm. That was five. I found this for five dollars at the exchange. They have never heard of it. They heard it was a shooter, but Raystorm is a great game. It is complete, and it has the foil. Awesome game. Oh, and uh, what's this? Uh, Bubble Bobby? <laughs> for the, It's made by Tanyo. Uh, it's for a regular PlayStation. I think it's a puzzle game. I can't remember. I think I played it once. All right, I know, man. This video is long, eh? That's because I have a lot of games for PlayStation, man. Oh, look at this! Got a no another whole thing to show right here. Ready? NASCAR '99. That was a dollar. Uh, bass uh, landing fishing. That was a dollar. Never played that one yet. Some fishing games are actually pretty cool. This doesn't have the cover. But it is uh, Snow, I think it's Snow Cross Championship Racing. There's the back of it. And then there's the game. Oh, let me put that up here. This is another, I don't know if this is an RPG, but I, it doesn't have the front, but it was a dollar. Carnal Sin, Sign or something like that. It has the back. I'll show you the back. I didn't try that yet. I need to try that. This is a great fighting game here to me. This is called Killing Zone by Acclaim. That was uh, $5 actually. This was 5 bucks at the exchange. $5. Tried that one out. Uh, the original uh, Twisted Metal, that was a dollar because it don't have the, the front. People actually want that to come back. Then we got Twisted Metal 4. Uh... There's the back. That was a dollar. Sorry for the glare. Madno 3, 50 cents. Spyro the Dragon, picked that up a long time ago for two bucks. Uh, HEV Quad Power Racing, that was a dollar. A lot of their racing games and shit like that were cheap, man. Cheap. Need for Speed uh, V Rally, that was a buck. This is pretty good. This this game here is pretty good. Uh, bugger, bugger something. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. I played it. It was pretty. It's pretty weird, but it's actually pretty cool. I paid two bucks for it. There's the back of it. Uh, it's, it's different, you know. But uh, if anybody knows about this game, let me know in the comment sections, man. But uh, it was uh, it was pretty decent. Rayman, two dollars. Uh, Cyber Tiger, a dollar. Oh, man, I have another one. I didn't even notice, man. That's how much I buy games. I have an extra <laughs> Tetris Plus. If anybody's interested in 
Tetris Plus for your PlayStation and you want to do a trade, let me know. Uh, just let me know in the comment sections. And if you have something I like for that you have and you want this, we could do a trade. Okay, because I got two of them. So let me know. All Star Racing, that was a dollar. Need for Speed Porsche Unleashed, that was a dollar. Formula One, that was a buck. Uh, what the hell? Muheim Hazing Racing, <laughs> that was a dollar. I don't remember trying that one out yet. Grand Tour Racing 98, I tried that one out, that was a buck. Uh, this one's okay. No fill down down uh, downhill mountain bike racing. Not bad. That was a that was a dollar. Ah, I used to love her and the show. Xena, Warrior Princess. That was a dollar for the PlayStation. NASCAR Heat. A dollar. Another one of those. Asteroids. That was uh, I think it was two or three dollars. So. That is what I have for my regular PlayStation. This video is, 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 is getting pretty long here, so we're going to show some PlayStation 2 games now. Like I, these, these were great games that came out for the PlayStation 2. So we're going to go through that, okay? This one here is uh, the King of Fires Collection. The Ochia Saga. That was five dollars at five and below, brand new. It has most of the King of Fighters games all on one disc. Great game. Sega Collections, another great game for the PlayStation 2. Everybody loves Crash for PlayStation 2. Resident Evil 4. DOA Hardcore. It's a great game on PlayStation 2, but to me, the best is still on the Sega Dreamcast. But this is a great version of it. Final Fight. Uh, this, is this is Final Fight Battle Volume Archives 2. I got that at 5 and below. It has a few of the other games on there. Uh, my son... George of the Jungle. Uh, it's a kid's game, but that was a dollar. He used to play that. Tokyo Extreme Racer 3. Not a bad racing game. Tekken Tag. Great game for your PlayStation 2. Virtual Fighter Evolution for your PlayStation 2. This version of Vulture Fighter never came out for the original OG Xbox. Great game to own for your PlayStation 2. Uh, Art of Fighting uh, Anthology. Uh, one, two, and three is on here. Pick that up for a few dollars. My exchange. Tekken 5. This is uh, the, yeah, the King of Fighters. Uh, I got this King of Fighters game at five and below for five bucks. At one time... Five and Below had a lot of those fighting games for five bucks, and I picked every last one up. Because a week later, they were gone, and there was a whole bunch of them. So I got there at the right time. Another great game for the PlayStation 2, Contra. It's another great game on there. A weird racing game, Road Trip. Man, this is a long video. Wipeout Fusion, pick that up for a dollar. Great games were on, or Wipeout is really good on there. The Girl You Love and Know from Will Fortune. <laughs> Vanna White, that was a dollar. Uh, Tekken 4, great game. Virtual Fighter 4, another good fighting game on the PlayStation 2. Street Fighter Alpha. Anthology for the PlayStation 2. Now you know that new version that came out now that you can get on a virtual system is kind of expensive. I'm not going to buy that until there's a really good uh, price reduction on that. 
But this has Street Fighter Alpha 1, 2, and there's another Alpha on here, Alpha Goal, and then there's Street Fighter Alpha 3, and then there's uh, Gym Fighters. If you guys can see that. Pick that up for two bucks at the flea market. This is Street Fighter EX 3. This is their version of a virtual fighting game, Street Fighter. And it's not it's not bad. All right, uh, Clash of the Titans for the PlayStation 2. Shinobi for the PlayStation 2. Now the other game I have in here is uh, it's the other ver I think it's the second or the first part of that because I don't have the cover, but I've got this for a, a buck or two, and it's Nightshades. It's a it's another version I believe of Shinobi on here but that's the the CD right there for that and I put it in here because there was enough room until I can find a case for it it's gonna stay in here but that was this is also a great game for your PlayStation 2 Rampage Total Destruction great game uh, this game is crazy man like I just said crazy crazy frog arcade racer it's not bad it's weird but it's not a bad game this is a very unusual pinball game. I love pinball games, and I picked this up for uh, three or four dollars at my local exchange. This is called uh, Flip Panic Ultimate Pinball, I believe, and it's actually pretty cool. It's it's a relaxing, laid back pinball game because the pinball the ball goes through jungles and shit, and you get the flippers in these different parts of the board. This is very unusual pinball game, but I like it. Soul Calibur Two, another great game. Taito Legends 2. Great game to get, man. With the Taito Legends on it, man. With a whole bunch of game, different games on it, man. Great games on here for your PlayStation 2. Sega Classic Collection. Another great one to have for your PlayStation 2. Oop, that was a GameCube game. Uh, King of Fighters uh, 2006. Got that for a couple dollars. Outrun uh, 2006, Coast to Coast for the PlayStation 2. Neo Contra for the PlayStation 2. Another great Contra game. Okay, uh, Battle 1 Archives uh, for the PlayStation, uh, PlayStation 2, Battle Fury. Volume 1. Has uh, Fatal Fury 1, 2, Fatal Fury Special, and Fatal Fury 3 on this. This is a great game I picked up for 5 bucks, man, at the uh, 5 and below. World Heroes Anthology. Great game. World Heroes 1 is my favorite. I used to play that game over and over and over and over again in the arcades. New Geo Battle uh, Coliseum. This was another one I picked up. Five bucks. Uh, Neo Geo uh, Cas Classic Arcades. Uh, man, if they can only make the cover, made the cover. Sometimes these covers, man. I got this there for five bucks. But it has all the cool Neo Geo games on it. That's the way to go, man. If you couldn't afford Neo Geo, you had to play it on your PlayStation or some of them on the original OG Xbox at the time. All right, this is Raiden 3. This was another great shoot 'em up for the PlayStation 2. R-Type uh, R Final, another great shoot 'em up for your PlayStation 2. I think this is Greatest 3 and 4. Another great shoot 'em up for your PlayStation 2. But that at a good price. And then we have this one called HSX Hyper A Sonic Racing Game. This was a dollar, I believe. I think at half price books. Not bad. And Time Crisis 3. Got that for a dollar for your PlayStation 2. Well, man, this guy, this video has went over, it's at 24 minutes. So. Uh, thank you for watching. 
thank you for subscribing, guys. I hope you like this PlayStation Collection video. That's what I own for my PlayStation 1 and 2. I showed you a lot of games for, for uh, Sony. So nobody can say that I hate Sony. I like Sony. But as I told you, okay, my favorite system will always be, for this generation, Xbox. Okay? And I can appreciate other companies and what they bring out. Because I show you that in my videos. So tell me what you think about some of the games I have. And also, like I showed you, I have a Tetris game. I have two of them. So if you're interested in that, anybody that's a collector and you want, want that, let me know and we could do a trade. All right? Thank you for watching, guys. Thank you for subscribing. And keep gaming. And, uh, and just enjoy yourself. And let's get excited for E3. Because uh, E3 is going to be great this Sunday. You know, check it out. You know, it's going to be for the whole week. And, uh, yes, there's going to be some things people might not like. You know what I mean? But everybody's not going to like everything that E3 brings. That's just the way it is. Okay? So, enjoy yourself, guys. Uh, have a good week. And I'll talk to you guys later. Sega Man out. And always remember, Xbox Attic for life.